I really like that it's an obscure Shakespeare play. Um, I think that it's fun to introduce audiences to, to plays that they don't know as well. And there's a lot in Cymbeline that's really cool. There's forbidden romance and Italian suitors and I get to dress up as a boy. <laughs> so, yeah. Which is kind of normal in Shakespeare. Yeah, I know. So. <laughs> Um, you know, along those same lines, um, I think one of the advantages of uh, performing, producing a play, a Shakespeare play that isn't oft done, is that um, you know most a lot of the audience may not know the story at all. And if you like, can imagine watching like Romeo and Juliet for the first time, and and seeing her wake up in the Capulet's tomb uh, next to Romeo, I mean, like what that moment must be like for an audience member that has no idea what the story is, and. Um, I hope in some way that audiences that come and see Cymbeline will be able to have those moments, um, those members who, who don't know the story and don't know what's going to happen next. I think that as Imogen, uh, she, you really kind of follow her story and um, she has many levels to her. Uh, so I'm excited to play that and, and I hope that that's something that the audiences will identify with. You know, she's quirky, she's romantic. Um, and adventurous and I think that, that that is something that everybody has in them and so can can experience through the show. <laughs>